Shit. A lot of rappers, like, I ain't gonna lie. I, I, I could tell Vaughn inspired a lot of rappers. Right. For sure. He inspired me for sure. I ain't gonna lie. Uh, I wanted to know that. Um, another thing I want to know, what's the hardest joint you ever broke? Because you got a lot of joints on it. I think you kind of got like a, a drill mixed with like a ride wave. It was like melodic, like, because yeah. I was saying too. So, shit, the hardest thing I think I wrote was. See, I don't really be writing no more. So the hardest thing I could say out that I wrote was until we meet again. Until we meet again. That, but like freestyle, so I like, cause I freestyle now. So I got a song yeah. called- uh, I'll say you wrote that? Yeah, until we meet oh, again, I wrote oh, that. Oh. And then I was in Atlanta when I wrote that. Okay. I wrote the hook, I freestyled the verses though. Okay. The uh, two verses I freestyled, but this song, it's a song called Angel that I, it's unreleased. Okay. I feel like that, but I ain't write it, but it's, it's off the top. So, so that's uh, the one you think? Yeah, that one. Then What's that about? It's, um, shit was just really just, I was just saying like, I feel like to lose all, lose everything. Like, mm. like my back against the wall and shit like that. Like losing my homies and shit, my auntie dying. Mm. It was basically, I was just saying how I felt. Then I got another song called Love Lost. I made that in October, that bitch. That's raw as hell. Like it was on some. I'm trying to have the whole hood out for that video, so that's gonna be raw. Y'all got that uh, for sure. So um, I don't really hear diss records from you. You not in that? You know, yeah, I don't diss. I, um, I just feel like it, it don't be no point of this. Like if I want to diss, I diss. But it's like shit. This and ain't go real. I don't. I feel like the motherfuckers who was like the the. All right, so I'm gonna say when drill started, it's only to me it's like only like three motherfuckers that made it fall out drill off this and that shit. Right. That shit that really shit Sosa, Dirt, her made it for sure. Her made it. Like they the only ones like from that starting the drill scene. They the only one that I feel like they up with it. Like, like they 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 oh like they top or not they top notch right. man. for sure. So I feel like it don't be no point of doing drill rap no more. Like some people like that though. Like. Like out of town people and shit like they like that like he and niggas talk about dead people and shit like that but yeah. really I just feel like you won't own, you won't get nowhere with that shit for real like you gotta have something different like I be trying to bring something different you know uh, you know what you saying that you know that's glad because I think got a question I think you're strong and you know a lot of people look up to you uh, and listen to your music I, I want to know something though. Cause it's a lot of people from old block who have became like legends in the drill rap game, and you know it's a few that has like passed away, unfortunately. Yeah. Um, how do you feel when you hear a song that's dissing somebody you know that passed away? Is that is that really weird? Cause that never, I mean, I never heard a song of nobody dissing like my dead cousin or nothing. Is so that that's tormenting? That's weird. It just shit. That's just what people do for attention, though. Like, I, yeah, it be weird. I be getting mad. I ain't gonna lie, but shit, ain't nothing I can do about it. Cause shit, it's just a song is a song. I just, yeah, I do hate when like when people be dissing my homies and shit, though. But I don't really, I don't show it though for real. Like, I don't never say nothing. Right. Like, you don't see me going live saying like this and niggas. None of that. I don't do it. Right. Ain't no point. I'm trying to win in a shit. They on that. I'm trying to win, win. Like they on. Some, uh. They don't even know, like, they don't, <laughs> trying to win-win. Right. I'm going I'm 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 to get my revenge in another way. Like, uh. I'm talking like, get my revenge, chasing M's, getting M's. And the niggas that's this, and they feel like, don't get nowhere near where I'm going to be. Right. Well, I'm trying. That's you know. a good mindset on it, though. Um, now, I want to be honest with you, you know, I put your name in my storyboard for about five minutes, man, and I took it off fast. You know, I didn't tag you. I was praying you didn't see it, and I do this a few times. I got one question real quick in it, because I took it out fast. Mm -hmm. I got one question in there real quick, sure. and it asked me to ask you the one question I seen. Yeah. It says, ask them about Zell Mana. And I see you got a song called Dark Stage. I'm gonna ask Long you live about, Zell Mana. Long live Zell Mana. I'm gonna ask you this question about him. Mm -hmm. Not to get too deep in it, and not to get too policey, but, mm -hmm. uh, a lot of love for him. I see a lot of videos on YouTube about him. A lot of people was upset when the news broke that he passed away. Where all that love came from with him? Zell was a Zell.